Before the video starts, please leave a like, subscribe to the channel, it's free and you can always change your mind. Ladies and gentlemen, everyone wants better ping. To this day, I've been running lots of tests with Exilag, trying to find the best routes and the best settings to get the best ping possible. And you're welcome. Anyways, today I'm going to show you the tests with Exilag and NordVPN binded together. Does it get better or does it make it worse? Let's find out. Make sure you use the link in the description to get 20% off exilag on your next exilag purchase all right so this is my normal ping when i just use exilag alone i use manama 01 but uh, recently i've been switching between dubai 01 and the manama 02 because manama breaks sometimes and this error pops up all right so i've made a lot of videos regarding exilag and the best settings the best routes everything uh here are the settings so uh, I'm just, as you can see exilag is turned on and then you go on fortnite i'm using manama because at the uh, the day of recording this video manama is working sometimes it breaks then i switch to manama 02 and dubai and then i have advanced routes which is zero tcp routes and four udp routes uh if you if you're still lagging and they sometimes disconnect use two udp routes okay the maximum is four but uh, i'm using four udp routes at the moment but i i also switch between four and two and one quick thing if you're not sure about uh, what routes to use uh i'm living in the south part of africa that's why i'm using manama because i get the best ping when i'm connected to exilag and i play fortnite and if you're not sure just use all regions which is the recommended one uh this will happen because it needs to analyze all the routes again another quick tip i want to show you guys is that whenever you change something in exilag for example i'm going Going to put manama 01 for example right now and if i go and switch to two udp routes it is always recommended that you optimize and then you update and then optimize okay that is like uh, the one rule that you must follow when using exilag and uh, now you go over to the tools tab i use uh, icmp which is the fastest uh, i sometimes switch between udp it depends on the good days but icmp is the fastest and it doesn't really have a big difference between uh, udp and tcp i use real-time optimization smart optimization and allow dual routes i have this two turned off because sometimes it uh, it messes up with my internet and gets me higher ping and yeah that's basically it on the fps boost tab i only have these two enabled do not enable everything because it might mess up your computer when it comes to nordvpn thank goodness it has south african servers and i understand that getting a hand on nordvpn is a bit much because you have to pay a subscription but it has free trials and you can console at any time what i recommend you doing is that you pay one month uh you test it out if it works then you keep you keep on using nordvpn if it doesn't work then you just cancel the one month and then game over all right so this is the nordvpn interface uh you first have to log in create an account everything and as you can see i have already been connecting to the servers and then you just go over here and then just click on south africa and then wait a bit and it's just going to connect which is right here as you can see this is africa and this is south africa all right now i'm jumping in a creative game make sure your server is switched to middle east because sometimes you might get connected on europe all right quick disclaimer i'm only testing this uh with fortnite i'm guessing that the same concept applies with every other game so keep in mind that i'm only doing the test on fortnite all right so as you can see my ping right now is 200 which is very bad and i'm using middle east servers and my exilag is turned off here's exilag here are the servers manama 01 let's connect and let's find out what's the ping going down going down 180 165 here is my stable ping ladies and gentlemen 160 i have never seen my ex uh, my ping go down when i'm using exilag is always 160 all right so i've turned off exilag right now pretty sure it's fine if i switch between vpns in the middle of the game i hope i don't get banned because that will be very sad let's connect to south africa on nord vpn it's now connecting and okay there's a big of 
bit spike over there 200 200 and interesting it goes up 230 220 okay so safe to say there's no point to using nordvpn on uh, on this game 220 ping it doesn't make any sense um i'm guessing it's because i am far away from south africa and i need to connect to south africa and then connect to manama which is very bad i don't know how exilag works all right so here's the other test i want to run which is to first to turn on nordvpn and then turn on exilag i'm guessing like for example i want the game to see that i'm first in south africa and then use exilag in south africa to connect to manama let's try that all right so nordvpn connecting i'll wait for this to it sometimes gets like disconnects and then comes back 230 i'm just waiting for it to stabilize all right stabilized now let's connect to exilag manama 01 can we update the routes the routes are showing a slight higher ping in my opinion and let's apply the routes let's now connect let's see in the game if it's going to give us something good i don't think it yeah it, it doesn't do anything yep it doesn't do anything lads what a waste of time and money all right so here's the second test i want to run so the second test i want to run is to disconnect nordvpn and then disconnect exilag and now i want to first turn on exilag and then i'm going to turn on nordvpn so in the game it's currently doing its stuff will it go down yeah it goes down on exilag 160 okay interesting now let's connect to nordvpn connecting to nordvpn all right now it's connecting it's one on 180 i expect it to disconnect for a bit and nope it it's it's doing nothing yep it's doing nothing ladies and gentlemen it is now sorted that exilag plus nordvpn it doesn't work all right so after doing some research i found out that nordvpn is a much higher uh, priority based uh, vpn so when i connect nordvpn uh, exilag is like non-existent in fortnite or in the system so that's why when i connect to nordvpn when exilag is turned on uh, nordvpn takes over and then puts it like it's just connecting to south africa and leaves exilag behind so it makes sense for exilag to not work while nordvpn is connected and exilag works alone better when nordvpn is not connected i hope you guys enjoyed please do leave a like on the video subscribe if you haven't dm me on instagram if you have any questions also do use the link in the description at the time of recording this video exilag is having a 44 percent discount you can't miss that dudes if you were to ask me i'll say do not buy nord vpn as it's a waste and doesn't work for gaming i'll just stick to exilag because it works i'll see you in the next video and peace